absolutely on fire for the Flames, scored in two straight games. Goals, that is, not just points, but two goals. So he is continuing his strong play this season. As we get set to go, Flames will start in Seattle, head off to Nashville for a game on Wednesday, Dallas Friday, and then wrap up this trip against Colorado and Denver on Sunday. This one underway. Glad to have you with us. Tell us Flames Hockey on Sportsnet. And at the back, first period as Mangiapane takes a look. Fires it down low. Sharon Govich plays it over. Fed back to the line. Lindholm. Anderson with the shot off the outside of the net. Mangiapane feeds it all the way back. Far side, Uyghur. Anderson, hard pass, Lindholm, shoot, scores! Lindholm, what a start! Minute 16 seconds in, Calgary makes it 1-0. And then they're finally going to get it back to Rasmus Anderson, quickly over to Lindholm. Lindholm was the last guy on the change. Flames finally chop it loose and have a chance to get it out. Connor Zary over to Capri, feeds it through. Here's Pospisil with a bit of room. Pospisil right in, stop, rebound, scores! They're going to wave it off, though. Pospisil ran over Grubauer. Rebound came back off the body of Pospisil and then Tanev again for Seattle. Watched by De Simone. Weinberg. Chips it back behind the net. De Simone got run over, didn't have the puck. Play continues. And here's a strange, I thought it was almost a no or an interference call. Turn pass from Pospisil off the mark, and that'll be picked up by Adam Larson. Slides it ahead, Yamamoto down the wing with a bit of room to shot off the post. Caught the outside, far post. In the bodies for a couple seconds. Clean win on the draw, done again, scores! A rocket right off the faceoff, and it's 1-1. Big faceoff win in the offensive zone. Wenberg with the win. And he's going to get it right back to Dunn. He's got a great shot, by the way, Dunn, leading their team in scoring. And it gets past Coleman up top. And Dan Vladar has a really hard time trying to track that one. It may deflect in off somebody. It's very hard to tell. I thought I saw, well, it's hard in this angle. One angle, I thought it may have just So it is Dunn's goal. Coleman chasing. Huberto follows up. Here's Backlund. Tries a shot. Huberto in front. Stick tied up. Alex Weinberg. Cattery breaks through. Gets the puck back to the point. Anderson will set it up as he plays it back to Huberto. Huberto with a shot. Scores! Huberto on the power play. Sneaks one through. And Jonathan Huberto right off the draw with a setup across the line, able to fire it home and make it 2-1 Calgary. Come against it near boards. Really good play right there. Tracks that puck down, gets it back to Rasmus Anderson. And then he's just going to give it to the left flank to Huberto. Tons of traffic, including Cadbury right in front. And that one sneaks five hole through on Grubauer. Probably not the goal that he's looking to give up that's from well out oh you know what that's deflected again as well on that angle it's pretty clear to see that it deflected and it wasn't five so hopped away intercepted by bjorkstrand scored bjorkstrand cuts to the front of the goal with a shot that's stopped by Bladar. so in comes joey to court period two is underway flames up by a goal puck chipped into the calgary zone by tolvanen have to regroup. Zeri. De Simone rims that and Beer bounce off a stanchion right in front. Pospisil with a shot and Decord able to make the save. Tumbles to De Simone. He'll play it ahead. Pospisil oh! chips it in. Onto its Cadre in front. Here's Zeri. Put a wide. Great look for Zeri on that chance. Try to go blocker side. Missed the net. De Simone with a shot. Block it away by Decord. Bumped by Cadre. So he did a really nice job taking away what would have been a a really good scoring chance. There's a shot from the point by Oleksiak that bounced wide off traffic. Giveaway. Here's a chance. Oleksiak stopped by Vladar. Took that off the shoulder. Schwartz out there with Beneers. Tolvanen, Yamamoto, and Dunn. And they'll set it up. Dunn feeds it over. Tolvanen shoots. Stopped by Vladar. Rebound. Slot chip to the corners. Backlund can't get it away from Yamamoto. Power play comes to an end. Two shots. They keep the pressure on him. Oh, Beneers! Stop by Bladar! Matty Beneers, eye to eye.
Dan with Dan Vladar, the Flames goaltender shuts him down. He's really open-minded, Huberdo is. They can continue to talk about each other's game and push each other. Says that isn't always the case, guys. All right, Ryan, thank you very much. Ryan Huska saying Coleman's playing his best hockey as a Flame these last few weeks. And loves his leadership. Here's a chance in front. Everybody on the backhand scores! Squeaking it through the pads. And it's a tie game. And just watch where he positions himself. Right in the high slot, here's the first attempt. Goes from forehand to backhand quickly. And this sneaks in through the five hole. Everly missed three games with a late cut in practice. And now, in the three games back, he has two goals, four assists. So he's on a bit of a chase after it. There's Everly. Passing. Bump back to Dunn, feeds it across. Larson shoots, and that was blocked by Weger. Comes back to Larson, that gets, oh, can all chip! Weger smashes a stick on the side of the goal. The Kraken have a 3 2 lead. Nice job. Adam Larson, he's got a bomb. Watch his shot. There's the first one. He's going to get a second one right there. And that hits a stick of McCann. I think it went off Lenar's mask, too. Well, it sounded like it. Oh, yeah. I think it was a combination. I think McCann. Yamamoto with some speed down the wing. Yeah. Cartier. Wenberg. Got it in front. Lenar with a big stop there. Off Cartier racing in. In that second period, we picked a whole bunch of plays in the first period where they were so good down low, and they lost that in the second period. Now, Seattle's been outscored 28 to 12 in the third period this year, minus 16 differential. 17 shots since the court's been between the pipes, and the Flames have yet to sneak one by him, but 413 left to change that for Calgary, trying to pull even in this one. Face off one by Leno. Hannafin picks it up off the board for the shot in the traffic. They score! Mangiapane tucks it in. Off the court, Andrew Mangiapane scores his 100th career goal and ties this game at three. And patience is the key to this one. The Flames kept pushing. Tanev gets it to Hannafin. What has Hannafin done so well the last couple of years? Gets pucks through. Decord is screened, Mangiapane, great job sticking with it. And just shovels that into the net. But that is, we have seen this time and time again from Noah Hannafin getting pucks through. Not always easy, but Coleman at center with 10 seconds left. Anderson gains the red line, dumps the puck in. Decord comes out to play. Time winding down, puck to the point, down the ice. And that will do it as this game is headed to overtime. 5-0. They had lots of chances in overtime against the Islanders the they other sure night. sure did. That was a fun OT. Backlund, Lindholm, Anderson for Calgary. Out there against Winberg. <laughs> and done for Seattle. Done with the puck. Makes a pass to Winberg, and he'll bring it to the line and out. Chris crossing with Schwartz into the zone. Schwartz picks it up, pocket picked by Backlund. He's on a two-on-one with Lindholm. Backlund slows it down. Anderson makes a move. Stop by the court. Now a chance for Seattle on the counterattack. To welcome those viewers watching Sportsnet Pacific. Overtime inside two minutes to go. Calgary and Seattle tied at three. Anderson down the wing. Anderson cuts all the way around. Wrap around. Turn away. Another chance. Goal! Rasmus Anderson completes the comeback and wins it in overtime. Flames 6 and 0 oh, all time in Seattle as they knock off the Kraken 4 to 3. And then a, just a beautiful rush here. Rasmus Anderson joins the rush. Decord gets stuck at the side of the net. Can't recover. And Rasmus Anderson gets his own rebound, elevates, and the Flames. Come back to win this one, 4-3 in overtime. What a great game. Here it is one more time. Watch Decord. He gets stuck and he can't recover. And puck goes off Larson, right back to Rasmus Anderson. And he's able to get it through the goaltender. 
What a thrilling win for the Calgary Flames. That's now nine goals by Flames defensemen the last nine games. That's right. 